That's it, ladies and gentlemen. It is over. Canelo Avarice is the champion. He destroyed. I mean, he put a whipping on Miguel Cotto. Miguel came off pretty good for the first round. Pretty close. But then after that, man, Canelo started walking down. Hit him with power shots, right hands, uppercuts, left hook, body shots. I mean, you name it. Canelo hit him with it. Now, I have to give Miguel Cotto credit. He took all those shots. And I think maybe Cotto was rocked maybe about two times, but he shook it off, got right back into it a couple seconds later. Um, but he just offensively just was no match really for the power of Canelo Alvarez. And, and that was a difference. And you see, both guys were kind of kind of big in the ring. I mean, they were probably about 165, 170. They are probably both about 170. But, you know, each one was landing the shots. And, and Cotto did land some good shots. But it's like Canelo, he just walked right through it like it was nothing. And, man, but when he cracked uh, Cotto with his power, man, Cotto, listen, let me tell you something. Cotto danced all night. But he did every now and then try to fight in little spurts, spurt here, spurt there. And he landed some pretty decent combos. But overall, Canelo Alvarez just beat him, beat him down. And he just kept cracking him over and over. Canelo was never in danger. Canelo took his time. And I told y'all before, Canelo is becoming a better fighter. Now the question has to be, now that he's the champion, now that he's defeated Cotto, where does Cotto go at from here? And then more importantly, are we going to see the Canelo Alvarez versus Triple G fight in 2016? Do you think that Canelo is ready to face Triple G? Leave your thoughts, comments below. What did you think about the fight? What could have Cotto done different? Was he scared? Did he not expect this from Miguel Cotto? I mean, from Canelo Alvarez? Leave your thoughts. I want to hear what y'all think. Make sure you subscribe or else.